Hi everyone and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, we are going to talk about how to take screenshot or do screen recording in restricted apps. Have you ever tried to take a screenshot on your Android phone and received an error message? Some apps block screenshots to protect privacy and security. Apps like banking apps, private messaging apps, streaming apps, and even the payment card section in Google Wallet use a security feature called Flag Secure. This feature prevents users from capturing sensitive information, such as passwords, financial details, or private conversations. While this is meant to protect user privacy, it can sometimes be frustrating when you need to save important information. If you face this issue and want a way around it, you'll face the same issue in other restricted apps like OTT apps, authenticator apps, private messaging apps, banking apps, and more. This video will show you how to take screenshots in restricted apps on Android. This method will work on any Android phone or tablet without root access. All the files that we are going to use are available on GitHub, which is owned by Microsoft, so this method is completely safe to use. First, we have to download an application called Exposed Disable Flag Secure. This application will enable screenshots in restricted apps. To make it work, we also need to download two more applications called LS Patch and Shizuku. In total, we need to download three applications. Exposed Disable Flag Secure is a specialized application designed to bypass the flag secure setting found in certain Android apps. This setting is typically implemented by developers to prevent users from taking screenshots, often for security or privacy reasons, such as in banking apps, streaming platforms, or private messaging applications. By using Exposed Disable Flag Secure, you can override this restriction and gain the ability to take screenshots in any app where the Flag Secure setting is enforced. This tool is particularly useful for users who need to capture important information for personal reference, documentation, or accessibility purposes. However, it is always recommended to use this capability responsibly and respect the privacy policies and security measures of the applications you interact with. LS Patch is a powerful patching tool that enables users to modify applications without requiring root access. It achieves this by injecting modules into apps, allowing them to alter certain behaviors that would otherwise be restricted by the system. This makes it an excellent alternative to traditional exposed framework-based modifications, which typically require routing the device. In this particular use case, LS Patch works alongside Exposed Disable Flag, secure to disable screenshot restrictions in apps that enforce the flag secure setting. By applying this patch, users can bypass screenshot blocking mechanisms without making permanent changes to their device's system files. Since LS Patch operates without root permissions, it provides a safer and more accessible way to modify apps while maintaining device security and stability. Shizuku is a powerful tool that allows applications to gain elevated system privileges without requiring full root access. Many advanced Android modifications typically need root permissions to function properly, but Shizuku provides an alternative by leveraging Android's built-in developer features. In this method, Shizuku plays a crucial role by granting the necessary permissions for LS Patch and Exposed Disable Flag Secure to function correctly. Without these elevated privileges, the modifications needed to bypass the flag. Secure setting would not be possible. By using Shizuku, users can enable these modifications in a safer way, avoiding the risks associated with fully routing their device while still gaining access to powerful customization features. Open your browser and search for Exposed Disable Flag Secure GitHub. Click on the first link that appears in the search results, scroll down to find the latest release, and download the exposed Disable Flag Secure APK file. Once downloaded, install the application on your device. Next, search for LS Patch GitHub. Open the first link, scroll down to locate the latest release, and download the manager.apk file. After the download is complete, install the application. The third application, Shizuku, is available on both GitHub 
and the Google Play Store. For convenience, search for Shizuku on the Google Play Store, download it, and install the application. Once all three applications are installed, you can proceed with enabling screenshots in restricted apps. Now let's proceed with the setup process. Open Shizuku and you will see a message indicating that Shizuku is not running. To start Shizuku, connect your phone to your computer and run an ADB command. However, before sending ADB commands from your computer, some setup is required. First, enable USB debugging on your phone. Open the Settings app, navigate to About Phone and tap the build number seven times to activate developer options. Once enabled, go back to the main settings menu, tap on Additional Settings and open Developer Options. From here, locate and enable USB debugging to allow your computer to communicate with your phone using ADB commands. USB debugging is a developer feature in Android that allows your phone to communicate with a computer using Android Debug Bridge ADB commands. When enabled, it lets your computer send instructions to your phone, making it possible to perform tasks that would otherwise be restricted. On your computer, Download the SDK Platform Tools. After downloading, extract the file and go to the Platform Tools folder. Connect your phone to the computer using a USB cable and make sure the USB mode is set to File Transfer. Inside the Platform Tools folder, hold Shift plus right click and select Open in Terminal or Open PowerShell window here. In the terminal, type ADB devices and hit enter. Once connected, you should see your phone listed. To start Shizuku on your phone, enter the ADB command. After running the command, open Shizuku. You will see that Shizuku is now running. Next, Shizuku needs access to the LS Patch application. Click on the Authorized Application tab and enable the toggle for LS Patch. Open the LS Patch application. If you see a message saying, Shizuku service is not connected. Clear the app from recent apps and reopen it. Once the service is connected, go to the Manage tab and click on Modules. Here, you should see the Disable Flag Secure module that was installed earlier. Now everything is set up and we are ready to remove screenshot security from restricted apps. Go to the Apps tab in LS Patch and click the plus button. First, select a directory where patched APK files will be stored. Choose any folder. Click the plus button again and two options will appear. You can either select an APK downloaded from the internet or select an app that is already installed on your phone. Select the Google Wallet app that is already installed. After selecting the targeted app, click on Portable, then click on Embed Modules. Select the Disable Flag Secure module. Tap Yes, then check the box for Override Version Code. Click on Start Patch. This will patch the app and disable the Flag Secure module responsible for the screenshot restriction. Once the process is complete, click Install. Click OK to uninstall the original version of the app and install the patched version. After installation, you will see a message confirming success. Now, the patched version of Google Wallet is installed. LS Patch also saves an APK file of the patched app, which can be used to install the modified version on other devices. Open the patched Google Wallet application. The screenshot restriction in the payment card section should now be removed.